They cannot ruin your celebration, and they never will. Please scroll on if this doesn't resonate. Someone has been acting out. Immature person. You have a celebration incoming. They can't do anything about this. But they're very. The person's very immature, and I think that they're trying to do something to disturb that for you. Here's what I mean. Like, it could be you got you're getting a, a new job, and all of a sudden they're going to start asking for money. Or, but I think it could be something bigger than that. Like. I don't know. It's, it's just somebody, I think you get a sense, and you already know this. I'm just confirming your intuition because of some little things they've said. And this could apply in other ways, but I just feel like someone, it was divine intervention, not luck, that you noticed this and that you're slipping away. Like, you noticed a red flag, and I'm supposed to tell you that. Like, basically, this person, someone has their eye on you, and I'm honestly thinking it's someone in your, could be in your family, could be a relationship. But I'm not trying to make you paranoid either. This is a specific message for someone who you're going through this right now. And you've been asking for a sign about it. Um, mm, like, it's like they came back in just as they... Uh, let me just use it as an example. This is just an example. But let's say... Um, now, who would do this? Like, if you ever win the lottery, don't post about it anywhere. Be as private as you can. Because guess what? People are going to come out and say things. But it's, it's like this person feels like you secretly won the lottery it's like you did that and this person's the only one who saw it and the only one they're the only one coming out or they it, like they just suspect that you have something okay this person just is noticing signs they suspect you have something and it's not necessarily a bad thing in oh gosh it could be look you're the one who saw the red flag okay like i'm not trying to speak anything bad let's just go let me just get a couple more cards here um you can do better yeah uh, don't fall for this. Like, it's just... Okay, I'm getting reminded, and this is how my messages work. Someone I knew who got a big windfall of money somehow. Okay, I'm not going to say how, but they got this bunch of money. Suddenly, they had a sibling who started contacting them, calling them, like, saying their house was going to be foreclosed on, and they needed all this money, and none of it was even true. And they found out later, and it was just like, why are you doing this? People go crazy sometimes when they think there's a bunch of money, okay? Now, I don't think it's necessarily that. I am using that as a metaphor. That's an example. They just, it, you know what? It could even be that they see you moving on to another romantic partner. Hmm. I choose you. Yeah. One more card from here. I wish I could hold you. I wish I could hold you down with them right now, honestly. Like, they are just seeing good things happen. But they were so immature, they couldn't, they, it's like there's something in them that they want to see good things, but they don't realize that the way they come, they come across would ruin it. They don't realize that it would be ruining it to let them have their way with it. Anyway, I'm, just, I'm supposed to actually congratulate you on, the, on noticing the red flags. I'm just getting a real love-hate vibe, because honestly, at the beginning of this reading, I'm like, this is someone who just, you know, they have evil intentions or whatever, but as it went on, I'm like, ah, it's like, I don't, I don't think the person realizes their intentions. They just want you with them, and that's the problem, the attention-seeking. Like, they're hurting you without trying. Like, they don't realize that kind of behavior is so hurtful. You are divinely protected. That's what I'm saying. Don't worry about any of this. Like, I'm not here to scare you or make you paranoid. You are divinely protected, and God wanted you to know that, okay? You're going to do better than this. You can do better, and that means just getting away from this entire situation. Two cards. Unique insight and reliable. Hmm. You already know the way out of this. You, um, hmm. Hmm. This is the big thing here, okay? This, the reliable. They just think that there's something you have that they're, anyway. I, I don't even, on, 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 ugh, I don't even want to go on too much more with this reading because what's the point like you are divinely protected um just just know this person has been watching i think they're um i think they are overestimating things or making assumptions about things let me just pull three cards what you need to the best advice you can get for this um they Anyway, you, there was something in this you were supposed to see. This divine protection and divine intervention. You need to trust the path, trust the process, okay? <laughs> this keeps coming out. You attract healthy relationships, which tells me this probably wasn't the healthiest. You put out good energy, and you cannot stop good things from happening to you. Good things are coming in fast. They see it. They see the good energy. They miss that about you. They miss just like this. They miss. They want to be right there in your hands, like in your arms. Yeah, I wish they could hold you. Yeah. Anyway, I'm just letting you know that they see you, they see you putting out the good energy and the good things coming in, and they want to be a part of that. 
that's up to you. You cannot stop good things from happening to you. It is spoken, it is written, and so it is. Amen.